Hello YouTube! Today we're going to talk about the Evergreen Art Supply professional quality artist grade what they call the ultimate automatic heavy duty pencil sharpener in 5, 4, 3, 2, Unboxing time, but first let's just kind of take a look at the package it comes in. All right, it says it's adjustable sharpness powered by AC battery and USB. There's three different power sources for this pencil sharpener. Sharpens quick, quiet, and even, and we're going to find about that. And we see that it comes in a variety here of tips. Blunt, medium and sharp that's the one I want sharp I'm not a blunt kind of guy but hey some people like that and that's why they make them all right choose between the blunt medium sharp we said that triple power supply we said that works anywhere you go anywhere you go means portable all right so wherever you happen to have a need for a quick and quiet and even pencil sharpener you should be able to take this with you and we'll look at that a little closer too and let's see ultra durable steel helical blade blah, blah, and sharpens quick quiet and even every time okay let's just get right to it I bet you guys are just anxious to see this and have me shut up right get right to it all right so we get through all the plastic and there she is. All right, we'll put that to the side. I don't think I'll be needing that anytime soon. And it comes with these instructions. All right, can you read that? Mm, is it Klingon? No. Mixi, mixi mitai. Mixi, mixi mitai no tokoro de. Hai, chiko shogai shite. Eh, chiko shogai. Hakkashi. Namae ga. I can't read that either. Uh, can't read that. Uh, oh, hey, English. All right, good deal. So let's see, what do we got to do here? Safety stop mechanism. It stops when the dust box is removed. Okay, that's good. Probably not a good idea to ever stick your finger in there anyway. It has a lead adjusting function, prevent over sharpening. Uh, someone ought to tell them, pencils don't have lead. Uh, anyway, that's what the comments keep telling me, but we call it lead anyway. I know it's graphite. Built-in AC adapter jack and uh, deep, deep, dry alkaline battery times four not included. Okay, batteries not included, just like the movie. All right. Right into the instructions. Nobody likes instructions. So I'm going to... Just go ahead and explain it all to you now. Okay, the interesting thing I find here is in the instructions it says, okay, uh, it takes LR6 alkaline batteries, four pieces, not included. Okay, well, yeah, I don't see any LR6 batteries but let's see if there's any inside. Let's go ahead and open this package up. It's pretty. This is really nice. I like this. It's got a nice substantial weight to it. Feels like solid construction. It's an evergreen art supply. Okay, yeah. I went on their website. You can find them there. This is where uh, I got this one from, is from Evergreen. And the folks there sent this to me. Says it's an EPS 500, but it's just known as the ultimate pencil sharpener on their website. Let's see the batteries. By the way, for those who don't know, this LR6, uh, that's kind of a designation for what we in the U.S. call AA batteries, like this Duracell AA. It's an alkaline battery as opposed to a little lithium or something like that which would have different designations so just in case you didn't know that because I didn't know that I had to look it up 
And let's see. Okay, it doesn't have any batteries, but it does have pictures of batteries. There they are. And you don't want to take that out. So that that's pretty good. I like the construction of this. This is really solid. I really like this. Anyway, I want to be banging it on the table. Let's go ahead and put batteries in. And you set your adjustments here for your point by sliding this little switch here. You can see and it shows you the different things. It's got the little rubber feet. Yeah, that's rubber. So that's nice to let it sit on the table. Yep, and it grips. So it won't slide. That's nice. Okay, good. Uh, and you sharpen from the top. Okay, that's a no-brainer. And let's see, how does this... Oh, okay, it just pops out. That's your dumping tray. Let's see, is that separate? No, that's one molded piece there. Okay, don't want to mess with that too much. And then you can see the sharpening mechanism inside there. All right. Now, if you take this cover off, according to the instructions, which I hate instructions. Ouch! And uh, it says that it won't sharpen. It'll just stop. So that's the safety thing so that you don't go, ah, right? Okay, so we don't want that happening. Now, the instructions also says AC adapter. So you can either go with the batteries or the AC adapter. And it says not included. And I'm going, then what is this? Looks included to me. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, it's included. You can, this is a USB thingy, and you can just plug it in there, and then plug it in the wall. Well, that looks like DC is supplied, so I'm not sure why it says not supplied, but Mine came with it, and I would assume yours would come with it too. Anyway, let me put that off this side. I already put batteries in here. We don't have to do both. Let's go ahead and let's sharpen with this puppy here, okay? So, what I'm going to sharpen with this Evergreen Art Supply Ultimate Pencil Sharpener automatic heavy-duty pencil sharpener is I'm going to sharpen one of my black wings and this one here is uh, the volumes and I believe it's volume 24 okay and I have a video on the unboxing of this if you want to go check that out in my playlist but look at these black beauties here huh whoa okay anyway so let's just use the ultimate pencil in the ultimate automatic heavy duty pencil sharpener. Y'all ready? I tell you what, let's do it. I want to make sure I got this on pointy. I want pointy. Got my batteries inside. Here we go. I guess that means it's over. Doesn't want to do anything more. Okay. There we go. That's a very nice point there. If you get the point. Yeah, I like to draw on my finger. There we go. Smiley face. All right. Good point. Now. Let's do this. I'm going to put this aside. I don't want to mess around with my black wing there. Let's take this other pencil here, which has a terrible point on it. In other words, no point. And let's remove this cover here. 
because it says it won't work. Now I just disconnected my cover here. Let's see what we got here. Hey, my pencil sharpener doesn't work. Look at that. There it goes. I may be pressing a little bit too hard on this thing. I don't want to, like, drag the motor down or anything. Oh, it's already done. I'm just kind of dragging this thing for no reason. That's already done. Okay, there you go. That's a nice sharp point there. Okay, now I want to try something else here. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to plug this puppy in here, this power thingy. And let's see what it does. Okay, we got to unravel it. All right. I'm going to plug it in. And then I'm going to plug it in here. Okay. Now we've got power from the wall through this USB thingy. And again, let me get another pencil. Let's try it again. Now you notice it sounded different, and I'll tell you why. Apparently the battery, one of the batteries that I put in here was a question mark. I, didn't, I just saw it laying around, and it must be a, a dead one. So it wasn't giving it enough juice, but when you plug in the juice, I got plenty of juice, and that thing, I think it's working real quick there. And if I had fresh batteries, I know that it would do the same thing so that you can go ahead and take this on the go. So anyway, uh, that's it. That's all I could say about the Evergreen Art Supply Pencil Sharpener, the EPS 500, as you can see here. As you can see, it's very substantial, very solid filling. It sharpens really nice. You can plug it up to a DC source via USB, or you can use four double A's or what they call LR6, and then take it on the go with you wherever you want a pencil sharpener and there's no power source available, like out on camping or whatever, uh, you can go ahead and just power up that way. I like this. It is now part of my collection of pencil sharpeners that I have here. And you can get this from evergreenartsupply.com. There's their little picture right there. Thanks again for watching my video. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up. Leave comments below. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.